When I have exchange students from Pakistan or any other place, uh, I do learn a lot from them from a cultural point of view. Uh, you know, when, when Gulzar came, we talked a lot about the different cultures and, and how they, they, they impact our behavior and, and various things like that. You're probably the most southern part of where they grow centifolia for any. Of course, we talked a lot about roses and what they do in Pakistan, yeah, which is very different from what we're doing here. We're doing landscape roses. He's doing fragrance and uh, raising roses for oil. Here I collected all the uh, different uh, varieties of uh, uh, centifolia which present here and I grow them and uh, from the leaves I extract the DNA from that uh, uh, centifolia plants and from the DNA I run the uh, PCR and I, with, I also have the two samples of uh, the centifolia which is present in Pakistan. Then I compare all these plants, the centifolia Pakistan and the centifolia here. Uh, then I compare that uh, if they are same or they are different, but the centifolia of Pakistan is different from the centifolia here. Here I feel that uh, uh, teacher, uh, the main focus is on the research. If they are studying a course, then uh, their main focus is to practical knowledge for the student. They take them in the field, they uh, uh, and uh, uh, work with them and then tell them how to practically work there. I feel such things are very good. And just to understand, uh, you know, as, as things happen in Pakistan, I can discuss it with them and try to understand what's going on because from our point of view, we get one, one story which sometimes is not always quite right. I mean, there's a lot of different perspectives on these stories. Before coming here, my uh, mind was completely different. Everyone helped me. Everyone cooperated me. I I I was I am amazing. After that, let's go with yellow. Uh, I think I have learned a lot in these six uh, six months. I mean, these many things I will also uh, practice in Pakistan. Things about how you live in Pakistan and the the limitations with respect. You know, simple things like electricity that we take for for granted. We can't take that for granted in every place in Pakistan. It comes and goes. I think most people don't realize how lucky we are and what, how many things we have here that many other people don't have. And I think that's important to realize from uh, when you start exchanging uh, ideas and, and trying to understand the work going on in different areas. I am also happy but also said that I am uh, living in this good place, yes.